my book project, Anne Frank, the Anne Frank House Authorized Graphic Biography by these two people. I can't say their names, so sorry. Start off, let's just read the summary. The Anne Frank House Authorized Graphic Biography is about Anne Frank's life up from the time she was born up to the time that she had died. It's also about the beginning of her parents' lives together. It's filled with parts, excerpts from her diary, the and little history things called snapshots that are in there to kind of show you what was going on at the time. For my facts, I chose Otto Frank, Robert Frank, and Herbert Frank served in the German army during World War I, and so did Julius Hollander, Edith's brother. Edith is, fr is Anne's mother. Margra Margot Frank, Anne's sister, was born on February 6, 1926, and Annalise Marie Frank, was born on June 12, 1929. On Anne's 13th birthday, June 12, 1942, Friday, she received the diary that she wrote in during her time in the annex that was in the building her father ran his business from. On 263 Prinzengrat Street, Amsterdam. And then on July 5th, 1942, Margot Frank received a call-up notice to report for a work camp in Germany. On July 6, 1942, the Franks went into hiding in the annex at 26-3 Princeton Grot, Amsterdam. Then later on, the Van Peel's family, who I guess were friends of theirs, I think they knew each other somehow, went into hiding with them on July 13th. They came a little earlier than expected as well. Then Fritz Pef Pepper, for a friend of Otto's, joined them, them in the annex on November 16th. On November 16th, that's when he came. Then on August 4th, 1944, everyone in the annex and the helpers are betrayed by someone Someone who works in the warehouse are arrested and taken to prison or concentration camps. Everyone is split up and taken to different concentration camps or prisons. Then, on May 3rd, 1960, the 26th Street, Street opens as a museum named the Anne Frank House. What I liked about the book was the narrative the snapshots of history, and pretty much the artwork for the comic style. What I guess I kind of didn't like was a little bit of the bittersweet ending with her father dying, and the place being opened up, and you finding out he's the last one to survive. That's kind of a little bit of a downer. Um, I would recommend it to people who have read the different versions of the Anne Frank diary and didn't really understand it. I would recommend it to people who want to read the Anne Frank books but do better with visuals. And that's pretty much it. And if I can, I will try to show you parts. So. This is kind of some of the snapshots.
stuff I was talking about. Here's the map school page. That's Anna and Marbon when they were younger. Thank you for listening, and goodbye.